Hello guys, in this video, I will show you how to modify your apps so that you will have multiple apps on your multitasking dock. First, it requires to have, your tablet requires to have Jelly Bean, which is um, available for all of the versions except for the US Wi-Fi only version of the Note 10.1. However, I posted a video of how to uh, modify your Note 10.1 for the US Wi-Fi only one to work with Jelly Bean and the link is posted below on the description you can check that out uh, first after you have Jelly Bean on your tablet you will be able to modify your apps down here to support like Adobe Readers or Google Earth or whatever you want however some of the apps does not work such as like Gmail for right now the developer haven't figured out how to um get that fixed but that's right now i could show you how to uh, modify the apps by yourself it's really simple and what requires it the uh, es explorer you can download the free version from google play store this is the app right here es explorer After you have modified your um, application, you are able to open them in like do window or cascading mode. Um, I could show you some example of what I have right now. This is assistant and this is my PDF reader. Um, I don't have any PDF right now, but just showing you. This is the official jelly bean. It's really fun. You're allowed to move them around. It's really fast and smooth. Um, not all of the apps are compatible with this, but you could try whatever you have. I have tried a couple of them, and out of all of the ones I try, probably eight out of ten of the apps that I have right now works. I tried Netflix. Netflix didn't work, but oh wow, don't really need that. You know, YouTube works. So yeah, this is it, and. I am going to switch to my computer now to show you how to get it modified and work with your multitasking duck. Hope you guys will enjoy this video. Welcome back to my computer. Well, first you need to get on this website, which I will have the link posted on the description below. Uh, called it the add multi window option. Okay, so click on that link. Once you click on that, you will first you have to make sure you have Jelly Bean installed on your tablet. Then you also need to have Java installed on your computer by clicking on this link if you don't have it. And if you have the 64 bit, make sure you download the 64 bit version. If you have 32 bit, download the 32. After you download it, run it, install it. And also make sure you have .NET Framework 2.0 or higher on your computer. And after you have done that, you should be good to go. Now, Back to the topic, you have to have, you know, you have to download this thing called Multi Window APK Modifier, that I do that zip. Download that, run, uh, unzip it. After you unzip it, you should get a window right here. Alright. Uh, after you unzip it, you should have a folder right here. Um, double click on the folder, right click on Multi Window APK Modifier, run as admin. Once you have done that, select the file that you have backed it up to your computer, which is what we have called Facebook. Um, look for Facebook, which is uh, 2.0 APK. Now you click on the output where you want the output to be, the destination for the output. I will save it on desktop, make it easier. Click save, hit run. Once you run it, It'll take a while, I mean, not that long, probably like a minute or less to get the file, sign it, or mod it. And once it's done, you should get a file um, on wherever you save that setting on my desktop and stay here. And just copy this file to your tablet, and I say my under um, the modded apps folder on my tablet. And I'll show you how to install it on your tablet now. Back to my tablet. Now once you have all that done, what you want to do now is to 
uninstall your um, Facebook app that you installed it on your computer. So what I mean on your tablet. So what you want to do is go to App Manager again on your ES Explorer, File Explorer, and hold on to your Facebook app that you have installed earlier. Uninstall that. Click OK. After you have that done, you want to go to your uh, files for the uh, the modded app, which I saved in my external card, and I put it in the modded apps uh, folder. And this is all my modded apps, and whatever you saved yours. And what I, what you have to do now is basically click on that, install it. Once it's done, hit done. Close this. Could close that as well. Now you go down here, and you should have your Facebook app back, which is it should be not. It shouldn't be here right now because you hasn't had yours done yet. So once it's done, you should it should be looking like this. Don't have the Facebook one down here. And what you want to do is click on Edit down here and tap on the Facebook again and it should appear right here hit done and your Facebook should work now yep and as you can see it works perfectly and this is the tutorial hope you guys enjoyed it you could try the um, other apps but it's not guaranteed that every single app works but just give it a try. I mean, it won't hurt me, right? But yeah, you might have to have your tablet rooted for the ES Explorer. And if you want to know how to root your tablet, I will have a link down in the description below. And you could try that out. So actually, I should have told you that before. But I'm very tired. <laughs> like I say, it's 2.30 in the morning right now. I mean, 2.23. Wow, really tired. Alright, thank you for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye-bye.